Hello and welcome to Eclectic Classes. In our previous video, we have studied about two types of proximity switches and their working principle. In this video, we are going to compare the two types of proximity switches or sensors that is, we will study inductive versus capacitive proximity sensor. Basically, both these are proximity sensors or switches but differ from each other on a number of parameters. So let's start with the differences between inductive and capacitive proximity sensors or switches. Inductive sensors use a magnetic field to detect objects while capacitive sensors use an electric field to detect the presence of any object. Inductive sensors can sense only conductive targets so our choice gets limited to metals while the capacitive sensors can sense metals as well as non-metals. In case of inductive sensors, the oscillation amplitude decreases with presence of the target object while in case of capacitive sensors, the oscillation amplitude increases with presence of the target object. Inductive sensors sensitivity cannot be adjusted while capacitive sensors are supplied with a potentiometer to adjust the sensitivity and sensing distance. Capacitive sensors are costlier than the inductive sensors. In case of inductive proximity sensors, metallic contamination like iron filing on the sensing face can result in false triggering, while the same won't result in false triggering in case of capacitive sensors. Capacitive sensors installation and use need extra care as it can sense any type of material so during operation it must be ensured that only the target object comes in vicinity of the sensor. If any other part also come near the sensor, it will treat it as target and start triggering. In case of inductive sensor, we need not be worried that much as it can sense only metals. So even if nearby non-metal parts come in vicinity of the sensor, it won't false trigger. This was all about this video comparing the inductive and capacitive proximity sensors or switches. If you have not subscribed to my channel, do subscribe the same and press the bell icon. If you like this video, please like it and share it among your friends. There are many more videos on my channel. Do watch them for learning many more concepts. I'll be back again with more new videos. Till then, stay tuned and keep watching. Thanks and bye.